love bugs is rosalind back at you one more again i hope everybody is doing blessed i'm doing blessed and highly favored and definitely hope the same for you and if this is your first time coming to my channel much love to you and welcome and to my returning subs my grown extended beautiful family just thank you for being you just you know opening up telling me about yourself and i know i keep telling y'all that but i appreciate that i love the fact that y'all drop comments y'all send a blessing and vibes my way is truly beautiful so you know keep doing that i love that and i'll continue to do the same for you and with that being said much love to all namaste love and blessings love and light and many blessings are definitely coming your way and if you have been watching my videos for a while and have not already please what are you waiting for like and subscribe even hit that notification bell at the bottom so you know when i'm about to upload my next video and if you are comfortable enough please go ahead and drop me a line or two i love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me even if it's about the positive feedback of the content of my video or you're just up telling me about your empathic gift and how it impacts your life and heading you towards a positive direction and if you feel like the video has been very informative to you and gave you good vibes that you would love to share with a loved one or friend please go ahead and do so and while you're at it give me a thumbs up like and even share on your social media favorites as well and thanks again for stopping by the channel and showing love and support now if you're able to resonate with the content of my video and y'all this meditation music is about to put me to sleep but it's so relaxing but we need to hear this every once in a while, at least about once or twice a week in our house. It's like uh, house cleanse, eight hours, um, eight hours of house cleansing frequency music. Remove old negative energy from home. And I will post that link in the description box below. And today my video is about Twin Flame 101. Hey, because what we lose, we will get replaced with better. You know, we... Because we always, you know, it sounds like when we, we lose something, either somebody done stole something from us, or you can, God forbid, you get robbed, or you lose something in a fire, God forbid, about that too. But it's just like a lot of things that we can lose, and we, we will focus upon the loss that we have. It's just like, okay, we can't bring this back. You know, it could be a person. But it's just like, you know, Dad, how can you make that better of a person? You can't bring that person back. But it's like, no, you can't bring a person back. But it's just the, you know, just the energy that you never know that you might, cre you know, create with another person and might connect in a certain kind of way that might remind you of that person. Or, you know, that energy has been from that person that has been guiding you towards another person that's like-minded like that person so you never know it's just like when we go through things you know we concentrate on the things that we lost you know I, I there's a lot of times I'll sit up here and think about shoulda coulda woulda with my dad you know when things have happened the way I've made um you know decisions about my life on things that I did on my own, own thing you know I can't just always blame my family for everything because I know I've done things myself too but it's like I can't sit up here and dwell off of that because if I look at all the things that have happened I would have never you know known the things that I've known about myself about other people knowing I could be able to help I could have missed my calling not going through this you know so it's just like it's a hard situation to go through when you lose a parent, especially if you have known the parent and never got to connect with them or, you know, anything else. It's just always sad losing a parent. But I know it's just like, you know, when you lose anybody, they're always there. The spirit is always there, you know, thinking about them and all of a sudden, you know, a certain situation will pop up and all of a sudden they'll, you'll think about them. That's just them letting you know that they're here. Or it could be a situation where you could have lost, you know, a significant other. You have to learn from that, that situation of that relationship. Be able to get strength from that relationship. You know, have your grieving moment when you go through that. But no one, you know, time will heal all wounds when it comes to a situation like that. Because it's just like we have to live the love and, you know, just live and love again. So it's just like when we when we lose relationships and things that you know go on in our you know in our lives, we have to be fortunate and be thankful for you know that that situation of being in our lives for that present moment, and be able to send it love and light, saying you know yeah I miss that or whatever. But you have to be grateful for that moment that you did have it, but knowing that there's something entering your life that is gonna bring you more happiness 
even though it could be anything. You're like, Rosalind, what are you talking about? <laughs> but I'm just saying, it could be something a lot better than what you expected. It's like when we, we, we can pray upon things. And with us being light workers, we are blessing people. You know, God sends us towards people that we're answering their prayers. And I've seen a post like that. And it, it almost made me cry because we could be praying about something and we go through a situation and we need that validation. So it's like it could be, like I said, a post. It could be somebody that you're talking to that you really needed guidance for. We really needed help. So it's, you know, we, we have things that come into our lives and we have to really look at it for what it is and be able to, you know, bless it. You know, if it left out of our lives, knowing, you know, if it's a situation with a friend, you know, things like that happen at times but you know you have to be able to be blessed for you being able to be in that situation you're blessed to be able to learn from that person whether if it was something good or it was something bad because whether it was something bad that gave you a lot of strength so actually that was a lot more good than it was bad even though the situation might have been messed up but it's like you have gained so much from those situations that you know even though you lost something look how much you have gained from just going through that you know after you heal you can really look at it for what it is so i hope you were able to resonate with the content of this video y'all this is not gonna be my last video i usually put out four videos to y'all but it's just like this week it's just been so long and then i just started working out again so just changing up my routine just to keep me you know just to keep me going and getting my body right or whatever so i'm like really tired <laughs> so it's like when i'm talking to y'all i'm just like you know, I'm getting messages from Spirit, and I'm just, like, being really slow about it. They say, you know what, it's bad when they're telling me I need to go get some sleep. So, I'm going to go ahead and get some rest. I hope y'all have a blessed, safe weekend. You know, you'll be warm, be safe, because I know a lot of places are starting to get the cold fronts in. So, I hope y'all are being warm. And if people are still blessed to have that heat, you know, God bless y'all, too. So, so now as much love and light and positivity as you possibly can. Know that you are blessed, highly favored, and truly loved. And knowing there is always somebody out there praying for your better days. And my post notification shout out goes to, let me see, let me see, let me see. Um, Drifty Clouds, I hope you're having a blessed weekend and much love to you. And Send out as much love and light and positivity as you possibly can. I don't know. I probably don't say that. But, you know, make sure you can send out extra. It makes you feel good. And give me a thumbs up. Like and even share on your social media favorites. And uh, hit the notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. And drop me a line. I'd love a chance to hear from you. Even if it's about the, you know, about the positive feedback of the content of my video. Or you just tell me about your empathic gift and how it impacted your life. And said, you towards a positive direction. And I will see y'all in my next video. Y'all about to go get some sleep. <laughs> Peace. <laughs> Be well.